Hello everyone and this is Inayat Meer with my AWS on-prem to cloud migration video series. This is my first video before I have posted three different videos using a cloud indoor method. This time I am going to go in much detail uh, due to the requirements. So let's take a look on that how we can migrate a computer from on-prem to AWS. So very first thing you have to go to IAM to create a user because we need a user with required credentials. So I do have two users but I would like to create a new user. You have to go through services and look for IAM. So here on the bottom, I am pointing out that what actually I am going to do here uh, with this video series. So I am on IAM, Identity and Access Management window, where you can see I have two users available. I am going to add a new user. User 3, this user will be used actually to migrate my own prem host into cloud or into AWS console as an EC2 instance. So AWS user3 is my username. I am going to grant this progr programmatic access also a management console access. Even you don't have to give this user a uh, console access but I am going to do that just in case I have to use this account for uh, several other purposes I have my customized password for this user now you can attach a policy first to grant some permissions to this user so here I have administrator access policy which I am going to attach so just ignore your tag and click on next. Now you have this administrator access policy attached to this user. I am going to create a user. Now you will need access key ID and a secret access key later on when you will prepare for a migration. So you have to click on download. To download this file later on I will go and show you this CSV file where I am going to copy my key ID and secret access key so this is going into my download folder just to show you later on I will open it up and we will go through this all details so I am going to go in very very detailed video so where I can show you every single thing what you need to have available to migrate your home uh, on-prem computer to cloud. So here you need to install first AWS CLI. So here we have a link where you can go and choose your 64-bit installation. This is your MSI file I have downloaded already. Just to show you here, you simply can go and search from your AWS console or from Google. You will get this link where you can install. So I did not install it yet. So if you try to go and look at that installation from the command line, you will not get it. So the way you're going to see here a demo in the first demo i will open up this screen i will leave it open where i will go and try to check that if we have aws cli installed or not the command i am showing you here aws space hyphen hyphen version so if you hit enter you get a negative reply because it will not be recognized the reason is that we did not install AWS CLI client or CLI yet. So here I saved into a different folder. 
the same file or you can directly go to your downloads folder double click and install this is a very straightforward a simple installation so just click on next accept the agreement click on next you can leave it as it is or default installation path and settings you can browse and go to change the path as well but it will go into your root drive and click on install this installation takes approximately 10 to 40 seconds you can say that okay so this is a live installation i'm not going to pause anyways my video simply to show you how quick this installation goes now we have aws cli installed now if you open up a command line a new command line it will basically show you the version so my host name is eight from advanced environment variables you have to verify that now we do have aws cli installed so once you go to system properties and envi environment variable you click on edit and look at the very last row under the c program files amazon aws cli and bin folder so this is the location where i'm showing you directly so so far we have everything installed so let's move on to our video number two where i will further explore the next step